Welcome to QA Insights QTP tutorial series. In this tutorial, we will see how to record and playback in QuickTest Pro. HP provides a great tool called Flight to learn the concepts of QTP. It is available as in Windows as well as in Web. Now we will see how to invoke Flight. Go to Start, All Programs. HP Quick Test Professional Sample Applications. Here you could see the Windows based application Flight and the web based application called Mercury Tools website. So I'm just invoking uh, uh, QTP and uh, uh, now we'll see how to uh, record actions using uh, Flight and we play back in QTP. So to record uh, uh, any application just click on record button here or you can uh, just press f3 shortcut key so here you could see there are two tabs the web and the windows application uh, here you could see only two as of now because i have associated only two types of add-ins uh, if you associate your Siebel or java or any other add-ins respective add-ins settings you could see in record and run settings dialog box so here ours is windows based application uh, so i'm just uh, uh, mentioning uh, what how it should record uh, and run so here uh, i'm just mentioning uh, record and run only on flight application so just click on plus button and uh, automatically uh, it will display the uh, flight uh, exe file path and just click on apply and then ok so now qtp will record only on flight application uh, by uh, invoking uh, itself so just entering the agent name agent name can be any valid name and the password is uh, mercury so just click our help button you could see the password and uh, you could see in the left side uh, whatever uh, the actions performed by me it is being uh, the code respective code has been generated with the qtp here so let's click on ok and uh, uh, flight reservation uh, window will get open here you could book the tickets and uh, you can check the uh, orders so uh, i have already performed some actions so i'm not going to record anymore i'm just exiting from the application so once you're done with your recording just click on stop so this is how you record and uh, uh, now we'll see how to uh, playback in qtp so to play back your script just click on run or you can uh, press f5 so here uh, it's i always prefer to use temporary run results folder uh, this will save uh, your whole memory this won't occupy uh, uh, any of your uh, local disk but if you select new run results so every run uh, the new folder will be created by qtp and clock by your memory so go for temporary run results folder and then click on ok so here you could see uh, the actions performed by me now it is performed by uh, QTP and uh, automatically the results will get open so just right click on uh, um, results viewer and expand all you could see the steps what plus steps uh, it has executed and the corresponding action and the result so this is how you uh, record and playback in QTP so in next we will see uh, what is active screen and data table thank you